welcome to Give Me Apps, your app mall, the number one app store, GiveMeApps.com. Download apps for any smartphone or tablet. If you're a developer, pay no developer fees, keep up to 100% of your profits, and withdraw your earnings via PayPal whenever you want. No app store lets you do that. Today we're checking out your fonts by Until Now Creations LLC for the iPad. This app allows you to create your own fonts, which you can use in your favorite computer program. You can send it to um, your computer via email or via Dropbox, download it, and boom. Use it within any program you want to use, like Microsoft Word, etc. Or, you can open up the font in a program like Your Letters by the same developer, which is Until Now Creations LOC, and go crazy with that. Uh, this is revolutionary in the sense that, hey, why not use your iPad for something like this? Many programs like this did not exist for Windows and the Mac, unless you had some type of stylus software. You know what I'm talking about. One of those tablets that you can use. And, I mean, at least back in the day, that was pretty expensive. It wasn't really an option for many people. But now, with the power of the iPad, we can make that happen. Enough talking. Let's get straight into this. We're a minute in. Take a look. Here's your startup screen. You need to create an account, and once you do that, it's pretty easy and simple. It's one, two, three, your email, your password, and you're set up with this screen. If you notice, we have the untitled tile over here. And that's a font that we were working on. We didn't really finish this up, but we'll show you around here. Take a look. You have like your ghost A, and you can either trace around that or have that disappear and work on creating your own fonts. And if you look at the bottom, you have all of the letters. You have A, B, C, D, E, F, G, all the way down to Z. And you have, with this tab, you have your lowercase letters. And over here, you have your numbers and other special characters like, you know, the hashtag, um... The exclamation point, you have your parentheses over here, you have your ampersand, your dollar sign, your percent sign, etc., etc. So you can spend time creating these individual letters, which is awesome, by the way. We have A, we'll do a B for you so you can see that. And remember, the idea here is that you are creating your own font still, be basically your handwriting. If you have any art skills, you can, you know, work with this and try your best to create different types of fonts, or maybe even... Uh, special characters or graphics. You know, if you open up Microsoft Word, for example, you have the regular fonts and then you have the ones with special characters. This would be great for that. And of course, when you hit whatever key you're using, the font that you see here display will show up. Or whatever um, character you made will show up. So you have your A, you have your B, you have your C. We're going to go crazy with that. We'll do our D. And just to be silly, we'll do some other stuff here. Because remember, you are creating your own font. So... There we go. We're using a weird stylus, by the way, so forgive if we have any weird um, problems with precision. Take a look. If you notice with the A, B, C, D, here we have the smiley face that we just made as one of the characters. So you're able to see what they look like before they go to print, before you send them out to yourself. And you have your F. We can do that all day. Uh, we have the lowercase letters, of course. Same deal. Uh, what's going to show up is what you created. So if you didn't create something, it's not going to be there, or you'll see the character default. Notice we have our A, B, and C. The rest of them look kind of, um, I guess, as the default, because they are the default. Anyway, you have your 1, 2, and 3. We'll do that. We're not creating everything in this review, just because of the time constraints, but we're going to do as much as we can. And there you have it. So we can either keep that, we can trash those, or we can go straight ahead and download them. And we can open them up in your letters. We did download that program. By the way, this program is $2.99, so it's not free. But look, you're able to do a lot with this. This is productivity all the way. We can create our own fonts. How many programs have you seen that allow you to do that on the iPad or anywhere for that matter? And if you open up in your letters, the issue is that you can't really use your own fonts on the iPad. Um, you have to have programs that support that, and this developer has created a program that will allow you to do that. Now, Your Letters is a program that allows you to send letters uh, or postcards to, I guess, anywhere in the world, to one of your friends or to anybody, and you need to buy credits in order to send those letters out. Or you can just use um, email instead and avoid that. And the whole idea here, in the context of this review, is that you can use the fonts that you created to do those letters. All right. So once you are done there... We can simply tap on the download icon. You get some instructions here. It says how to use your font. And from there, you can download the font. Now, we can do a couple of things. We can open it up in another app, which is what we're going to do. We can email it to someone or yourself or open it up in Safari. Now, if we tap on open in other app, there's our Dropbox link right there. We're going to tap on open in Dropbox. And if you look... Uh, our untitled font is right there, untitled.ttf. Now, 
Again, the whole idea is simple. Once you um, email it to yourself or throw it in Dropbox, you can open it up on the computer and install it, and boom, there you go. Right there you have um, you know, your font that you can use in any program. Photoshop, Microsoft Word, um, any word processing program you can imagine, there it is. Even Paint, for example, if you don't have access to Photoshop or an expensive graphics program, there is your solution. Now, we are flabbergasted by this. We are surprised. We are happy that something like this exists because it gives us more power. Imagine if you are a graphics editor or if you're a graphic designer or whatever you are and you want to have um, access to fonts that you created, this is the program for you. You can do that from scratch and you know it's a very cheap solution. $299, I mean in the app world everybody, everybody wants a free app but for $299 you really can't go wrong with this man. This is great stuff. So this is um, your fonts. Create personal handwritten fonts. This is by Until Now Creations LLC. Just for the sake of the review, we're going to open up your letters. We know that this is not a review of your letters, but we're going to show you that. We're going to flip the orientation here. This is by the same developer. And um, if you look, you have examples of letters. Take a look at these tiles over here. We can tap one of these. Create new. And it's going to ask you if you want to do a letter or card. We're going to go with the letter. And take a look up here. We can change the fonts, the font size. And if you look, Untitled shows up right there. So the fonts that we created using the program show up in this. And we can create our own letters and email them or, of course, send them out by purchasing credits. So you want to check that out. This is on your letters by the same developer. We can trash that. We can get rid of it. And we have a lot of other options here. We can change the color of the, um, the background, the paper that we're going to use. And we have the other options over there. So there it is. This is our preview. All right. Or we can just get out of there and take a look. If we tap on the uh, settings icon here, we can purchase credits. We spoke about that earlier. We're just trying to show you what you can do here. And you can purchase using PayPal. And that icon is right over here in the middle. All right. So we're talking about your fonts. This is by Until Now Creations LLC, a powerful program. You can create your own fonts from scratch. Use it to make special characters. Uh, a million fonts. We normally go to sites like one, I think it's 10,001fonts.com and you can download a lot of fonts there for free or pay special licensing fees. But you can avoid that because with this program you can create your own fonts from scratch. So this is amazing. We say check it out. This is definitely worth $2.99 for what it allows you to do and you have complete power here. You can do whatever you want. We can create special characters. We can draw whatever we want to do per key we can set that up in this program. So once again, your fonts. Create personal handwritten fonts. This is for the iPad. This is a home run. We say get it. Check it out. $2.99. You can't go wrong with this whatsoever. It's very easy to use. We did not have to crack open the manual because it's pretty intuitive. So kudos to the developer. We are Give Me Apps, the world's number one independent app store. Download apps for iPhone, Android, Windows Phone. WebOS and many other operating systems. If you are a developer, pay no developer fees, keep up to 100% of your profits, and withdraw your earnings via PayPal whenever you want. No app store lets you do that. Once again, your fonts by Until Now Creations LLC. This is $2.99. It is worth every penny. Pick this up, guys. We hope you enjoyed this review as much as we did. Till next time.